I got a call from Carmen and Corey to be a part of. Do the tube house. Tube house. I'm finna do anything to build my channel up. I don't know, I guess we could work on that, whatever. I mean, that's what you wanna call it, the situation. I'm flirting with him or whatever, and then all of a sudden they send Kiana in there. <laughs> I'm coming back in this room. We were trying to work on our relationship or whatever. They, every week I get blocked. Mom doesn't wanna work with you, and she, he wants to work with her. I got screenshots of me her talking about, okay, this is what we gonna do. I'm gonna DM you, this and that. Yo, you gonna break your keys, and I'm gonna never gonna know where. So I'm gonna put it. But your man wanna be here. Oh, bye. We were shooting the reunion the other day. They went at it. <laughs> we didn't get done doing the videos over there until about 10, 30, 11. They never went to the two pops. Y'all want to know where they went? They went straight to this. Who you know Kiana's going up his phone? After everything that happened, Kiana ended up going on YouTube and exposing everything of what happened, which you guys already know about. But she also said, This shit y'all seeing is entertainment, bro. But when a mother step out of boundary, out of YouTube, that's where, that's where you cross the line. All this shit entertainment, but not this shit real life, because mother is playing with me. And I'm talking about Dez and I'm talking about Prime. And I saw my mama life. She felt that Prime and Dez were being disrespectful. And had the nerve to post that video, disrespecting the fuck out of me. That's disrespectful as fuck. And Dez, you disrespectful too. You grown you know what the fuck going on. I don't know what he telling you. I don't know even know if I should really be mad at her. Because he he could be telling her anything. For her to be a woman, you gotta be smarter than that. Because I'm not finna be sitting here tripping for nothing. Don't believe this cap ass nigga is cap. He gonna do anything to get himself up. Like he used me, he'll use you. As he's doing right now, I think he made that clear. She says that Prime's a liar. And he's a liar. All he do is cap on the gram. And y'all go see that one day, bro. Tell me I'm throwing tension tantrum. You know how disrespectful that is? You look at it and bleach your I just threw your eye and cut up your hats. You look at it and go farther than that. I got a little bit of care in my heart. She talks about Prime begging to be back with her. He's talking about he loved me, y'all. He wanna go back up with me and stuff. And she also brought some really good points about if you're trying to bring your channel up, why are you not collabing with her? Because she does have a lot more followers than Dez. I'm not trying to sound cocky, but if he was trying to go back up with me, why you ain't doing that? I got way more numbers than this girl. This girl's getting numbers off our name, really mine, but off of our, off of our real you know, situation, our real breakup. So if you really want to go back on YouTube, why didn't you throw me on your channel when I have more numbers? And we, you know, we do numbers together. We have a, we have fan pages. We had a, a fan base. So I'm confused. Y'all wanna know why? Cause he looks up to Miami the Kid. Can I look up to Miami the Kid and try to do videos like him, but try to establish a relationship with a female you so-called love? You playing games with me, bro. I'm a grown ass woman. You go do that sh ass girl. Then she says that he has a good heart. You have a good heart, bro. You just let social media you up in the head you dead hurt the fuck out of me and i will never in my life look at you the same and i know you hate i know you you go feel my pain bro i know you probably hurt him watching this video because you know you wrong he switches the role up on prime and asks him how he would feel if the situation was switched and what he was doing she was doing how would you feel if i was in the house till 3 a.m putting on his chain and you know lick of a video done or how would you feel if i was out with a nigga four or five hours and both our phones dead. It's be business, right? Now it's getting personal. And Dez, where's your so-called boo at? I'm so confused, bro. Cat, flaw, I don't support this no more at all. I don't support what they got going on. It's fake, it's flawed, it's disrespectful. It's sad, it's humiliating. It hurts me, bro. I've been through too much. She felt that Prime looked at her as like some type of competition. I must have felt like a threat to you, which I don't understand why. I would never look at you like that. I always want to build together. But I knew when I told you I wanted to go back on YouTube with you and you said, no, you want to do videos with other people, I should have known right then and there. It was a competition. I don't compete with nobody. I want to see everybody win. Y'all can ask my friends. You cross some you love for a random ass bitch for clout. Something temporary, bro. Clout ain't gonna love you. You're gonna reap what you sow for real. You go understand that shit one day. But you still a boy at heart. You, you still got a, a kid mind. She then wishes him the best. Love you, bro. Wish the best for you. But I cannot support what you're doing right now. Because it's disrespecting me. But it wasn't over. Because she spoke some more. Basically asking how Dad felt comfortable with the situation. Dad, how you even feel comfortable having another female in your house till 3 a.m.? How do you feel comfortable? He has to be fe feeding your head with lies, for real. Clout one hell of a drug, for real. And I ain't the play with. I'm sitting here uploading this video. I just gotta say something else. Like, both these playing with me. 
I'm not a play with. And nigga, you trying me like I'm not that. I'm a boss and I can have any I want. You wanna do that to me? I'm really sitting here, you know, posting it. And I just had to stop real fast and make this like, Dez don't know me. But Prime, you know me. You know how to get down. I ain't no regular ass. Now, Prime ended up going on Instagram. Here's some of the things that he said. I saw my another YouTuber. How the F that sound? It's two people in the relationship, so y'all can believe one side if y'all want to. 100. I just said spoke on sh yeah. Hurt people hurt people. So the best believe I wasn't the only one doing wrong doings. Now, this ended up going on the Teen Shade Room. Des ended up getting a lot of heat for it, so she ended up making a video responding to the situation. And I explained her side of the story but she also said it was put out on the media yesterday and how they tried to betray my name and slander my name and none of that shit is true and today i'm about to clear that shit right now make a video trying to play victim and crying and this this and that and you claiming you telling the truth but tell the whole truth tell them that this this all this shit was for entertainment purposes and you got in your feelings tell them how we're not friends we never were friends so why you sitting here trying to slander my name and make me out to be the bad guy tell the truth how about that honestly it's just it's it's just because we all on the same management and we all agreed to working and putting out content for y'all being youtube she confirms that she does not want prime i don't got to do with nobody relationship i don't have nothing to do with nothing i don't want prime i never wanted prime all i know was they weren't together and we were all working under the same management that's it Point blank period. But she responds to Kiana's reasoning for being upset about their phones being dead or whatever. Stop playing with me like your phone ain't never been dead. I feel like she shouldn't have never agreed to work in. She knew that she was gonna have, she had insecurities within herself or she felt like I was gonna take prime or whatever. How can I take somebody that's not even yours right now? And now due to the confusion and everyone not really knowing what's going on and looking at all the stories and the fake drama, they started questioning Dez and her motives. And the main thing that I keep hearing people say over and over again, why are you posting videos with prom when that was your friend? I'm not gonna say this again. I don't know this bitch was never friends to begin with. Like I said, all three of us work together for business purposes only. Y'all can dead all that other Dez felt that Kiana was basically trying to make Dez look bad by saying she was a friend, not realizing that that was a, what management wanted. So the fact that you're trying to portray this on the internet as, oh, um, th this girl was my friend and now she's trying to talk to my ex dude and this, this and that. Shut the f up. Like, you're a joke. She confirms that her and Prime are not doing the What's this? You know what I'm saying. <laughs> Why the fuck would you sit here and try to make it seem like me and him are having sex or something? And to clear that up, me and him ain't, we ain't did shit together. We ain't had sex, we ain't kissed, we ain't nothing. Everything has been business, business, business. Like, they're not even together, so why are you getting mad at him for working and trying to get his content up and trying to get his, you know, his subscribers back up for his page that got deleted? Why are you that why? mad? You that says that she felt really surprised at how Kiana reacted to the whole situation. I feel really f***ed up about it because I wasn't expecting none of this to happen. Like, I didn't I didn't expect her to be this type of Like, I didn't even get that vibe from her at all. But it's just messed up because we both black women and we're, you know, in the entertainment business doing this YouTube sh And we ain't never supposed to tear one another down or even let a guy get in the way of the business and turn things personal like like i said it was never ever supposed to go this far but kiana was not happy she saw this video and made another video which she eventually deleted you got me f all the way up and you know where exactly where the f i'm at so if you want to see me you can see me period i don't do nothing you got on youtube straight line straight line so i'm from we beat bitches up like you quit playing with me bruh you got on youtube straight capping y'all you tried to make someone I was jealous of you, bitch. I ain't never been jealous of you, bitch. I ain't even the video I just posted saying I'm done. I ain't even said this is pretty. Even though I got a problem with her, I still don't hate. Pretty, she pretty. Bitch, this nigga flew to Houston begging for me back. Talking about, can you please take me back? Can you please take me back? I wanna be with you. I wanna go up with you, shit. Bitch, we fucking raw, bitch. We had a whole ass apartment together. We working on something. So yeah, bitch, I take it personal. I'm gonna tell YouTube the whole truth and nothing but the truth. And it's crazy because it's talking about, oh, I was saying she was my friend. Bitch, that was the fake, that was the fake YouTube 
my real video I just posted saying I'm done, I even stated in the video, I said that Daz does not know me, but Prime does. Y'all please go back to that video, screen record it, and post it. I said that. What the f*** are you talking about? Kiana says that Dez is fake because she knew about the situation between her and Prime, but again, Dez apparently did not know because apparently management was telling her that they weren't together. That main video was about how Prime been treating me and, sh and how it led up to here. You act like I made a video straightly about you. And yeah, I said you was fake because you knew the situation we had going on, whether you was my friend or not. You know what I'm saying? Is he doing at another house till 3 a.m. not doing shit business related for that amount of hours? How? What? Like what in these fights got personal? That's why I'm tripping, Dez. Anyway, Pry ends up uploading a video explaining his side of the situation and he claims that they were single since February. And stop capping to the internet and to these fans, supporters, thinking that we were together when motherfuckers were single since February, bro. I've been trying to work things out with you, bro. But how the hell are we together right now? We're not. Motherfuckers single, bro. All them posts you do on the internet, I'm I'm moving on. I'm this, I'm that, I'm focusing on me, bro. You post that shit at least three times a month. I felt that Kiana manipulated the situation to make both of them look bad. You, you got these folks really thinking, bro, in the head that I'm a ass, slime ball ass. They think I'm your friend. How the hell we know that? She a business partner, bro. Don't make it seem like y'all was cool, bro, because y'all was not cool. Now, for my conclusion. What is fake and what is real? So that has been a real big confusion with everyone because the lines between what is reality and what is a stage present and what is fake is so blurred because a lot of these YouTubers and they're acting as themselves, improvising, acting. So a lot of it is so confusing, so mixed and everything. What was fake was at the start, the whole thing there was stage. I'm pretty sure Prime would have known that Kiana was coming in. Kiana knew she was gonna be there. Uh, Dez knew that a girl was going to come in so yes that was propped it up that was staged then afterwards there was this fake thing of her flirting and trying to steal Prime away from Kiana but the thing is they weren't even together at the time they were trying to work on their relationship so that part is fake Prime and Kiana trying to work on the relationship was real Kiana getting suspicious that Prime is cheating on her with Dez when she wasn't even together, so it's not cheating, is real. That part is real. So it's like a dead fake story came into reality and manifested into reality. Like, <laughs> what the hell? Kiana has some right to feel some type of way and some suspicion. Saying that, Prime never claimed her. She felt that Prime claimed her because he f her raw. I don't give a fuck if y'all got a title or not. If a nigga raw, that's your What type of naive shit is that? I don't know what these boys be doing, Kiana, for real. If you think someone fucking you in the pussy with no condom means you're an item, there's something wrong with you because these men be fucking everyone raw. They be fucking other men raw too. And ladies, please don't go around thinking that because you were intimate with someone with no protection, it means that you are a couple. That is Far from the case. This is something that should be shared when you're in a committed long-term relationship. I he didn't do anything wrong because he never officially claimed you. Yeah, he said he'd want to be back with you, which seems very misleading. But did he ever make the claim? Did he say, yeah, we are together? If you are working on a relationship, that means you are working on one. Don't be one of those ditzy we're working we broke up and now we're working on our relationship and um i'm on and off with him and like it's such a big mess now, saying that it is so weird this dez and prime relationship dez said she came into the tomb house because of carmen and corey but in the video she said it was because of prime i was invited yeah. uh, oh. by no, Prime. And she also gave Prime a hug when she walked into the house. Uh, hi. Yeah. Like, which shows that they knew each other before the house. Now, I can't help but to think that Prime maybe has a crush on Dez, and Dez doesn't feel the same way with him. But they could have been doing stuff. It's really hard to tell. See, if I was um, Kiana, I would have played so smart. I would have made sure I got hardcore evidence. You know where they live? 
If you don't know, ask the manager. Be like, hey, I'm gonna do a surprise video. Like, lie to them and then really go over there and stalk them and see if they're doing stuff. If, you know, if you're giving your body to him and all that stuff, I don't see anything wrong going to see if he's really doing stuff with another girl, if he's claiming to be with you and stuff like that, you feel me? But I only do that when he claims to be your man, okay? Because it looks weird if he ain't your man and you go in there spying on him and shit, trying to find out what's going on, if he playing, you know, down the rabbit hole with Dez. Dez lied about why is Kiana in her DM press about Prime when she knew it was staged. Asking me about Prime and I basically told her like, look sis, I don't want your n I have never texted him none of that shit. And she was like, hey, we not together, but I just want to know, do y'all talk? And I'm just like, this conversation is pointless as fuck. According to Kiana, those messages were for her scripted video that she made on her channel. I got screenshots of me her talking about, okay, this is what we gonna do. I'm gonna DM you, this and that. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna DM you, act like I found out you was talking to Prime. You know what I'm saying? All that shit. If that wasn't the case, why would Dez say? I just feel really about it because I wasn't expecting none of this to happen. Like, I didn't, I didn't expect her to be this type of I didn't even get that vibe from her at all, but uh, I was not expecting this. I, what? It makes sense you weren't expecting this because you knew beforehand with the messages in your inbox was all fake. It was staged. That's why you're surprised about this one. So why are you lying about that being real when it was fake? It's so confusing. It's like the way they handle this drama is just really messy. Kiana has no one to blame but herself. She put herself in a situation with knocking with someone and getting intimate with someone with no protection who hasn't even claimed her. She assumed because he effing her role, it means it's a claim, which is completely naive and wrong. He has every right to do what he wants to do until you are officially together. I definitely feel that maybe Prime has some crush on Dez because let's put two and two together. If you really want to grow your channel, why are you not collaborating with Kiana? So he could be collaborating with Dez because he has a crush on her or because Kiana was right and he ha he wants to be like Miami the Kid. But hey, I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. I don't feel like I'm 100% accurate because I don't feel like I know every single thing and I have to ask these people to understand. Saying that, I don't think it's Carmen's fault. A lot of people are blaming Carmen. Carmen did knew, like, she knew it was fake drama. They knew they were going to be improvising. It wasn't real to begin with. But anyway, guys, that's what I think about this whole situation. If there is something that I missed, let me know in the comment section below, and I will come live, and we'll have like a special reunion, and we can talk about it, okay? Let me know in the comment section below about that, and I'll see you guys in another drama video.